Hi, I'm Vic, and welcome to Geeko Park, where we do things differently. But before we do all that, a couple of things uh, to keep you up to date. Our trusty Mazda CX-5 Newton is going to go to a new home to be replaced with the uh, Outlander PHEV uh, sometime at the end of August, which means I get to clear all the crap out of the car. But fortunately I'm a little bit more mobile now. My uh, my wrist is doing well, and I have some physio exercises. And here's my physio exercise, and I kid you not, right? Got to do ten of those. Do it with my left hand. Feels like somebody else is doing my physio. Anyway, back to the garden. Here we are uh, planting in the garden, but we have discovered that Kanye, bless his little cotton socks, will spot new plants and go, hey girls, salad bar, um, and all our hard work is ruined. So we are making stick frames here from stuff gathered in the grove, covering it with netting, and no salad bar. One of the things we're planting are these lovely, um, well, we call them Fibonacci because of the beautiful florets in there. I think we've done a video on them before. Anyway. These are going in here, uh, which will eventually be our rhubarb bed, but we can't find any rhubarb corms. So we just take these things, find out how long they should be, and cut them to length with our handy dandy little tiny chainsaw. There. It's a little bit bent, but that doesn't matter. The important thing is that there's enough headroom for me to get in there to do all the weeding. So I can duck in there, no problem. Uh, we tie them in place with uh, recycled binder twine. We're tying them in place with uh, reused binder twine that I've salvaged from uh, the hay bales that we compost to make the centre of our garden bed. And then we cover it with strawberry netting, which is easy. You just do like that. The light is fading. And I'm afraid that's going to cut our video short. So for now, that's your lot. Down on Geeko Farm.